This is California Congressman Eric Swalwell, a man the shark has exposed for his ties to the notorious California-based Rowell Ranch Rodeo, where horses have been electroshocked and animals killed. Swalwell is now officially running for President of the United States, but we have no intention of letting him run from the violent animal cruelty that he supports. In our previous video, we exposed how Swalwell had been a Rowell Ranch Ranger and official advisor to the rodeo, and how once we brought this up, the page on the Rowell Rodeo website was altered and his name removed. In other words, instead of acknowledging the cruelty committed with his support, Swalwell simply tried to erase his connection to the rodeo. Shark reached out to Swalwell a number of times about the Rowell Ranch Rodeo, such as its history of electroshocking horses. We asked him about insane events, such as mutton busting, which is dangerous to children, and wild cow milking, where grown men tackle and abuse lactating cows. In 2014, a cow broke her neck and was killed when she tried to escape the rodeo thugs assaulting her. We asked Swalwell about Russ Fields, the man who runs the rodeo, who made the following idiotic claim on TV. Do you deny that the animals feel fear? No, I don't, I don't think they feel fear. They're really? an animal. Yeah, no. We asked him about the incompetence of the veterinarian who was on site when a horse was killed and the rodeo's anti-transparency policy due to its ban on video cameras. Did Swalwell, who wants to run our country, take responsibility or denounce any of what he or the rodeo he advised did? No. He said nothing. Swalwell was also the Grand Marshal for the Livermore Rodeo Parade in 2017, and his congressional website promotes both that and the Rowell Ranch Rodeo. In fact, it states, quote, both rodeos offer fun for the whole family. Unless you are sociopath. The animal cruelty committed at both rodeos does not constitute fun. It is violence. It is abuse. It is cruelty and death. In this video, we are not telling people who to vote for or to support one party above the other. What we are doing is exposing politicians for their hypocrisy. For instance, it is more than ironic that Swalwell, who has a lot to say in his regular appearances on cable talk shows denouncing President Trump for not taking responsibility for his actions, has acted the exact same way when it comes to his history with the Rowell Ranch Rodeo. All that Swalwell has done and not done on this issue is cowardly and unbecoming of a man who seeks the highest office in the land. Please politely and respectfully contact Congressman Swalwell and ask him to stop supporting animal cruelty. Please let us know if you get any response. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel.